gifts in the corner Why you singing it's gonna bug me too You're floating in a flash I don't So uh, I'm sitting that. here at the Disney Listen National with my buddy Rennie over here who is one of the co-designers of this brand new 20... 2011. 2011, yes, Frank. With a couple of new features and a couple of new geometry and a couple of new things like uh, that right there, as you can tell. Bottom mounted chain tensioner, it's spring-loaded. So you never have to worry about gear changes. You don't have to about worry about changing uh, chain stay lanes. You don't have to worry about adjusting your brake position. So you just keep it where it is and the spring will take up the slack. All right, cool, man. How many of these you got in production right now? Our first batch was of 200. We're gonna fill up some more orders for 2012. Got a lot of demand, a lot of interest. And we're shipping worldwide. We're just picking up distributors from New Zealand, Australia, France, UK. We have a lot of international interest in this, as well as the US. I know, where did uh, where Yes originally come from? Because I remember in uh, the late 90s, it was a big up north Canadian thing. Well, we still are up north in Canada, actually from Vancouver, West Coast. And that's where we manufacture all of our frames. For the past 15 years, we've been manufacturing other brands, mountain bike brands, even products that aren't even in the bicycle business. And this year, we decided to come up with our own redesign, we engineered, and we worked with the New Zealand High Performance team. Oh, you guys work with the, the New Zealand team, huh? With Ken Cools. Okay, okay. Now, question on the new redesign. Is that part of this whole top tube, down tube feature? Yeah. With this Y? This was actually part of our old frame. This is a little bit of old school mixed with the new school. What this does is it, it improves the lateral stiffness of the rear end because it, it incorporates a, a mini triangle as a support, sort of like a truss system. And that's how you get a lot more stiffness in the rear end. And everyone knows with the stiffness that's less pedal or less energy loss when you pedal. Oh, just keep the power to the back wheel, baby. You hear that? So I'm going 2012 right there. Check that triangle out right there. A little added yes for stiffness. And part of the new feature that we have is right in the bottom back here. Is that for you? Okay. Right here. You can see how the chain stay is connected to the down tube. And that's how, that's a method of manufacturing that we do, special to this frame, and just this year, where it actually wraps the bottom bracket a lot more than the traditional BMX frame. Okay, now I got a question. Is this the production complete model, or is this somebody on your factory team? Like, like if I were to go to the store and buy it right now, am I walking out with a pair of DXRs on it? Right now we don't do a complete bike line or complete bicycle frame. We just we just make the bicycle frame. We don't do the complete bike. These are parts of some of our sponsors that we put on and to help us promote. Because if you have a bicycle frame and you you don't really you're not able to try it out, you're not allowed to you can't really demo it without parts on it. But the key word to this guys is this word right here, prototype. Which means there's not a lot in production, so uh... That's for the fork only, actually. <laughs> this is just the first one that we made of this, pro this fork. And we still have to do some design reiterations. This isn't the final product, but it's being tested and to our specs. If you've seen some of our old forks way back in the 90s, it has some of the features that, that this one implores. Alright, cool. Give me your website. The website is www.yessbmx.com. Check us out or check us out on Facebook or Twitter. Thanks a lot. All right, thanks, man. Take it easy.